I remember Ben Stiller and I, we went and we had uh, dinner with Mick Jagger right. because early in Ben's oh, career, we. Now that I'm jealous of. Oh, no. I totally ruined it. <laughs> we were writing a script about. Uh, the Rolling Stones called and said, hey, will you do a, a movie? It's a concert movie, but in between, there's comedy and a little story. This is when Ben... <laughs> That's easy. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. It's a terrible idea. Yeah. And so, but Ben, this was right after the Ben Stiller show was canceled. Mm -hmm. He wasn't really famous yet, and he wanted to do it with Brad Pitt. Hmm. And Brad Pitt wasn't famous either. Uh -huh. We're like, hey, we like this Brad Pitt guy from uh, Thelma and Louise. Right. So suddenly, Ben and I are talking to Mick Jagger all the time about this script. And Mick Jagger, by the way, only wants to be a movie star and wants to direct movies and stuff like sure. that. Yeah. And he's he's super nice. We're doing phone calls with him. I'm recording every phone call. Right. And then do I'm, you tell him that? or? I, of course not. Of <laughs> course not. <laughs> you're, you're a sneaky guy. Because I know that there's right. no way this is going to really work out. Right. And, I, and on my computer, every time I screwed up, uh, the alert... I, I made it a sample of Mick Jagger, so if I mess up on my computer, it would go, that's funny. <laughs> uh, and, uh, and then we went and had dinner, and I couldn't talk. Wow. For an hour, I just, I didn't say a word. Ben kept looking at me like, <laughs> like I was like the wrong? freak. Yeah. And then finally, I was trying to find a way to relate to him, and I'm like, yeah, I, I go on the road too as a comedian. <laughs> <laughs> when you're on tour with the Stones, <laughs> I'm, I'm on tour when myself. That's, arenas. That's, <laughs> a, that's a lonely life we both share together. Yeah, so. you know, I'm thinking of writing a song about it <laughs> on the road again. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's crazy, right? I know there are certain people you just can't pull it together. Yeah. And and uh, I would imagine Mick Jagger. I always wanted to interview Mick Jagger. I mean, that I, I that, in fact, you'd need 10 hours at least to, sure. at least to, to make a dent in that life. Now we have to pitch the whole band the movie. Ah. So it's Ben and I have to go uh, and pitch the, you know, the entire Rolling Stones. Now all the jokes are about like Keith Richards having his blood replaced. <laughs> it's all yeah. like addiction jokes and right. the mythology of the band jokes. And so Ben says, okay, I'm going to pitch. And I'm like, okay, I'm going to chime in. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna You're just, the chiming in guy. Ben's yeah. the pitch guy. Yeah, I'm going to throw in some jokes. <laughs> yeah. And so Ben starts pitching it. And I totally lock up. I'm <laughs> terrified. Ah, Keith Richards no. is looking right at us, and oh. I'm just and white. he's intimidating, right? He's too cool for the room. Terrifying. Yeah. And Ben starts pitching, and uh, Ben's like, "Hey, so let's uh, we're gonna do it. Uh, let's do it like kind of gimme shelter style, you know, that kind of cinematography." And Keith Richards goes, yes, but this time let's do it without the murder. <laughs> <laughs> They're funnier than you guys. Yeah, like like right. that murder's become a cocktail <laughs> party <laughs> joke. Right. Uh, and then Ron Wood kept like raising his hand going, I say we do it. I say we do it. And then Keith. Uh, <laughs> you can tell he only gets a partial vote. <laughs> yeah. 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 He came in late to the stones. And Keith is going, okay, why don't you direct it too, Alfred Hitchcock? <laughs> Ah, this is the movie, if you ask me. <laughs> and, then, and Keith, and it was really funny because Ron Wood was so enthusiastic, and he kept annoying Keith Richards. So he's like, "Well, I, I think we should do it." And he's like, "Okay, Brian Jones." Oh. <laughs> and I'm like, "What does that even mean?" Uh, I, yeah, I, I, you're I making know. fun of Brian Jones, poor uh, bastard. So uh, you know, we finished the the pitch, and then uh, we walk out of the room, and now we're like at the door right next to uh, where they're debating it. Right. Uh -huh. And Ben wants to listen. To then debate it. <laughs> like they were like, go downstairs, but Ben's at the door, and I'm like, Ben, Keith Richards will stab us. Right. We can't do this. So we go downstairs. It's like a, a gym in Toronto. They're like practicing for the tour at a uh, high school. We go downstairs, and then uh, Ron Wood just gives us a thumbs up. Like, you're in. Wow. Like, we're going to do it. That mm -hmm. shitty pitch. Exactly. Yeah. And then we sit down, and they're like, hey, you can watch us rehearse. So in this little room, we watched the Stones perform just for Ben and me. Oh my God! For like two and a half hours. Wow! Oh my God! And it was unbelievable. And in the middle of it, every once in a while, Mick Jagger would walk over and go, "You guys okay? You need some water? Oh my God! Are you God. all right?" It was, and I kept saying to Ben, "This is the best moment of our lives. <laughs> <laughs> Don't ever forget this moment. This won't happen again." And then ultimately, uh, it fell apart because Brad Pitt got this other movie. Seven, oh. right? <laughs> you know, though. But 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 what's so amazing? Like I've interviewed Ben a bunch of times, and and I've I've interviewed you, and like that to you guys, like that's a major. That would be the major story of my life. I could you stop living after that. that. You know what I mean? And you guys have so many experiences that you probably have even sort of filed that away somewhere and never even told that. Anywhere. That's not true. That's the best story I have. <laughs> oh, is it? You tell it a lot. <laughs> well, I I did know at the time, like, oh, this is crazy. 